Hello, this is Lucas Palmeira from Imaginando and I'm here to give another tutorial on the RC. Today I'm going to show you how to make some sounds from the song Hungry for the Power by Azari and Third, um, Jamie Jones remix. We're going to do uh, some sort of guitar sound, a background sound, a pad, a bass and a lead. So we're going to start with the guitar and let's go to our DRC going to turn off this K70 DRC and bring it back to a default patch. Okay, and take out this send that we have here with a reverb and let's start. Okay, first thing I'm going to change the first oscillator to a square wave and the second one as well. Then I'm going to change the square to uh, the pulse width modulation, the pulse width, sorry, of the square to 688. Um, and then I go to the amplifier and I raise the oscillator to, to 807. Okay, about here. Now I raise the ring modulator to maximum and the pre-gain to 733. Okay, about here. Now, on envelope generator 2, this envelope generator 2 amount is the one that Set, uh, controls the cutoff filter, uh, how much of this envelope generator that's modulating in time will control the cutoff filter. And for that I'm going to change the attack to one to 190 for now. No, to 0 0.34, sorry. 0 0.34. Decay at 244. Remember, we're on the second envelope generator. The sustain at 549. And the release at 190. Uh, sorry, 286. Now we go to the cutoff and we drop it to uh, 484. the resonance to 386 we change the filter from a low pass for pull to a bend pass to pull and now we go to the envelope generator 2 amount and we drop it to 323 Okay, now we raise the LFO2, this LFO2 to 269, the LFO2 controlling the filter, 269, and now we drop the rate to 168. Okay. Now for the first envelope generator, this one modulates the attack, the the amplitude of the sound, and we raise the attack to 190, decay at 196, sustain at 289. It should be okay. 298. Sorry. Perfect. Release at 190. Okay. Last but not least, we go to the attack velocity. This means the with different velocities, the attack will have different times. And we drop it to 410. Okay, like this. Now we give it a little bit of reverb. 
and we turn on the K7D that has um, time of one eighth dotted. As a character, we have full wow, ping pong on and medium stereo width, a bit of spread, a half dry wet, and a feedback of about 266. And now, here we have our kind of sound of, of, of a guitar, and let's go to the background sound. This sound is quite easy and fast to make, so let's get right into it. And default patch on. I'm gonna take the sand and the K70. Okay, and now we change the first oscillator from a sawtooth to a sine wave, like this. Master and oscillator one at maximum, like normal. Now, we drop the cutoff to 354. Like this. And now we go to the reverb and give it amount 370. And decay at 555. A little bit more reverb. And here we have our sound. Now let's just give it another K70 at one eighth. We didn't, I didn't touch preamp, feedback, dry wet at half, and the character just has whoa and a bit of flutter. So from this to this. Okay. Now for the pet sound. As you can see, there is a little bit of automation here on the cutoff that you can check out afterwards here on the session. But for now, let's open the RC, send it back to the default patch. Okay. I'm going to turn off this delete for now. And now, oscillator one, uh, what we're going to do is go to the second oscillator, drop one octave like this raise it, the amplitude oscillator to, to maximum. And I'll fine tune the second oscillator to 0 0.1. Okay, like this. Drop the pre-gain to 609. Okay. Now envelope, gener uh, envelope generator 2 that modulates the cutoff, this one, let's drop it to 323. 323. Cutoff now to 106. Okay, like this. For now, release it to 292. Okay, and now we go to the first envelope generator that controls the amplitude and we raise the attack to 0 0.76. Decay at maximum, sustain at maximum, and release at 0 0.3. Envelope generator 2, 130 on the attack. Now decay at maximum, sustain at maximum. and release it for 165. Okay, now let's give it a little bit of reverb. And limb, our limb is with a time of 0 0.363. The feedback I didn't touch, basically, but I can put it a little lower. Low rate, half depth, spread at maximum, crossover low, and dry wet at maximum, and we got this. Nice broadening stereo effect for our pad. So now let's go for the bass. And on the bass, let's bring it back to the default patch. Okay, and on the bass, what we're going to do is basically 
bring the pregame to maximum. This is going to be easy as well. Don't change anything else. Just go to the envelope, uh, cutoff at zero. Resonance at 162. Envelope generator to amount. We're going to drop it to 287. Okay, now on the second envelope generator, we're gonna raise the decay to sev uh, 729. Okay, sustain at 346. And finally release at 220. Okay. The sustain on the first envelope generator actually is 274. And the release is 202. Okay, like this. 0, 0500, 274, and 202. Second one, 0, 0729, 346. Two to zero. Okay, here we have our base. And finally, let's go to our lead sound. Another DRC, back to the default patch. Take the send. And now, master at maximum, pre gain at 908. Oscillator 1 at 801. Oscillator 2 at maximum. And now, envelope generator 2 at 500. And cutoff at 688. A resonance at 548. Change the low pass for pole, uh, low pass for pole mode to a low pass to pole mode on the filter. Okay. Now uh, envelope generator one uh, decay at zero point five, sustain at zero point eight, release at zero, and envelope generator two decay at two hundred and thirty, sustain at. 717 release at 627 okay like this now we go to the reverb and we raise the amount to 316 decay at 465 and the dampening of the reverb to 591. Now we raise again the lead. Okay, give it a little bit more reverb on the sand and we got it. So let's now listen to the melody that I've recorded before. So bear with me just a second while I get this ready. I think everything should be ready by now, so just wait a little second. Okay, I think, yeah, I think everything is ready to go, so let's now listen.
and this was it guys i hope you have enjoyed this tutorial remember that if you like our channel please subscribe and give us a like we will have new contact content coming up next week and all the weeks after that so we'll see you then goodbye guys